Hi, I'd like to share with you some tips on cleaning your Daniel Smith uh, masking fluid applicator when you're finished with it. As you can see, uh, I do have masking fluid in this little applicator tip. First of all, you want to clean it immediately after use. You don't want the latex to dry inside your tip or it will clog it up. So the, the best way to do it is to take it and hold it under a faucet and allow running water to flush out um, the masking fluid out of the applicator tip. Once it's dried, you can try taking a needle and loosening up if you've allowed it to dry and you haven't gotten to water fast enough. You can try putting a needle down and inserting it to loosen up the latex that's been dried. However, this is a very fine needle here and it's actually too large to fit into this one that I haven't cut down. When you've cut them down, you can fit them in a little easier, but this is at its very finest, which is too fine for this needle. The best way that i found for flushing out my applicator tip is to, once you've gone to your second bottle of your Daniel Smith masking fluid, is to clean out the first one and put fresh water in it and label it for water H2O and then use that to flush out your tip. So apply, put your applica dirty applicator tip on your um, old masking fluid and then press, just squeeze until you're flushing out your applicator tip and then pull away so it can flush out the, um, the thicker part here. And now you have a very clean applicator tip ready to use for next time without clogging up. So those are a couple tips on how to clean your Daniel Smith masking fluid applicator tips.